Nice. Yeah, it's been a good response, isn't it? It would have been very easy to... set point they've played and Munar wins it. Oh, so many lines painted, but Wu just drifting that lot wide and Munar somehow wins the set. That was impressive. The speed around the court. Apology for the final shanked volley. It done at the third opportunity and we are heading into a deciding set back to business A nice change up. Got Munar on the run into his forehand corner. No! Oh, nothing fluky about that. ever happened <laughs> a warm beer instead of a really cold one nice touch and a good effort woo matches public they each have a hold to love and they each have a 
advantage. That's the one area where you can see some of the inexperience, I think, of Wu already. Struggles continue on the forehand, just... This time it's not coming yeah, back. Well, it took six efforts to get it done, but Wu's got himself the opening set. Since that time, at all levels, qualifying. And Oh, my. They seemed out of position as if there was yeah, no yeah, chance. True. And yet Wu got the extension and came up with something special. Yeah, and in 86 yeah. minutes, Wu topples Publik and picks up his first tour-level victory. That's a heartbreaker. That is just going to sting and leave. And that's a sizable okay, stumble, but he's helped out by some brilliance from Thompson. And it is Jordan Thompson. Stellar effort to hang in and hang tough. In the first ever encounter with Gael Monfils, he's got the Frenchman on the ropes. He's going to have the love from the crowd. Warm on the ATP Tour. A little spot of bother here. And Thompson has his third break. Perfect three for three when holding a break point. And there it is for Jordan Thompson. Just his second win in 2023. And although on paper it'll say he beat the 210th best player in the world, this one's going to feel good nonetheless. That's a nice start from Nakashima. Love 15. That's nicely done. Nakashima consolidating behind the point against the Isna serve. That's nicely done.
He's done it. And Nakashima knew the deal there. He just had to get into the point, and then once in the point, simply had to win it, and he did. Not having one of his better days and two match points down. Brandon Nakashima records a third victory in four matches against John Isner. And a very solid, level headed performance from the young American. And Isner, 16 years Nakashima's senior, far too many unforced errors on the day. Nevertheless, this young man had to keep his composure and at times...